Hey guys, this is CP Row 43, and uh, finally I'm coming out with a new update. This is the first update since uh, before I went on my trip, uh, besides the new camera update which I uploaded yesterday, but uh, the camera is not really going to be important in this one. This is actually just for the uh, what's happened along the layout and anything new, which not much has happened. Anyways, I'm going to cut right down to the chase uh, with the new stuff. So while in Kelowna, uh, I found a hobby shop that was there. It was uh, uh, called ABC Hobby and Games, and it was in the I don't know, um, right by their mall that was uh, just off of Highway 97, and uh, what was the road that was cornered? Uh, so Dilworth Street or something, I think Dilworth something. I know that. It was in like a little strip mall and uh, I decided to check it out and uh, it was definitely more expensive because if you don't know what BC means it either means British Columbia or bring cash and in this case it was definitely bring cash because the gas stations were so were very expensive and then uh, the whole a whole bunch of model railroad stuff there was also expensive but uh, I picked, found these brushes which was by their paint stuff and uh, they were 50 cents each and I thought that was a good deal so I picked five of them up uh, they're nice fine brushes. They're nice and soft and durable. Uh, they're small, which that's uh, awesome because that'll make it easier to work with uh, when it comes to powder weathering. And uh, I will come out with a possibly a, a new weathering video once I can get more dull coat or clear coat for the powder. But uh, I have tested one, just kind of put, put some powder on one of my uh, rolling stock and it looked very nice. Uh, I was able to do a lot more with the brush. So, certainly pretty cool, and I like these brushes, so I will be definitely using them. Um, so, n I haven't really done anything with the grain elevator, and uh, so I hope to get an something done with it, and then I can update you guys again. But, uh, um, like, nothing has happened since it was last updated. Now, on to these two photos, which I have uh, right up above my layout. So as you don't know, this photo right here, I had entered into last year's First Choice Savings Credit Union calendar contest, and it won for this year's calendar. So I decided to enter this photo, which I took in Canmore uh, back in April, and would you believe that it actually won uh, this year's contest for next year's calendar? Because it did, and so that was another 100 bucks in cash, and uh, a framed version of it, as you can see here. And the photo will be featured in the in First Choice Savings uh, next year calendar. So that's pretty cool. Uh, I still have another photo that might be a candidate for next year's contest if they have one. But uh, we don't know that yet. Hopefully they will. And uh, that would be pretty awesome if that photo wins. Anyways, um, I think I've said everything actually. Because, so yeah, not a whole lot has happened. So um, I think that is pretty much it with this little update. Uh, so yeah, finally I would get that update to you guys, and I hope you enjoyed it. So until next time, this is CP Roll 43 and good luck.